Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect Character AI to your Discord right away. This will allow you to infuse your Discord server with AI generated content, whether you want to enhance your server with automated responses or create some unique interactions integrating the Character AI. Of course, Character AI can bring a whole, a whole new level of engagement to your Discord server. So make sure to stick by, let's dive right into this video and simply let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you will need to go and create a character AI account. To do so, go and open a website that you have or sorry, a browser that you have. For me here, I'm using Brave. For you, you can use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, basically just go to this URL section and here you will have to type character. AI and hit the enter button. Once you do so, you'll be taken here. So click on this first link, which is character.ai, and as you can see, personalize AI for every moment of your day. Once you click on it, make sure, of course, to go here to the bottom left corner and click on sign in to sign in into an account if you have an account. If you don't have an account, instead go and click on sign up to create a new account for your own. Of course, you can do it through the normal way or the manual way, entering your email, etc. Or you can use Google or Apple if you don't want to get through all the boring steps of creating or even logging into your account. So for me, I'll just go and click on continue with Google, choose my account in here, click on continue. As you can see by continuing, Google will share your name, email address, language preferences, profile picture with character AI, and see character AI's privacy policy in terms of service. So you'll have to see it, of course. And you can manage your sign in from Google account if you want to like remove it from your Google account, remove the link. So once I click on it, as you can see, I'll be linked into or I'll be connected to my account right away. As you can see, of course, if you don't, you'll have to go and create a new account. As you can see, you can even try their better plan, which is character AI plus, which will let you skip the waiting room, faster response times, early access to new features, uh, character AI plus community access and profile badge which will be very helpful, especially if you're intending to connect it to your Discord server. So now you will have to go, once you created your like account, you can go here and click on create, and you'll be able to create a character of voice for us. We would like to create a character. We would like to basically to create a, a bot. So once you click on create, as you can see, you will have to give it a name. So the name will be, I'll just name it sister. Uh, to search alker why not you can give it a tagline as an example add a short tagline to our character i don't know testing description so this guy will test like conversations with you conversations with you why not in greeting so i'll just type hello i am tester uh, the tester, why not? I'm just adding some random stuff for you. Make sure to add like your stuff if you care about it. Voice, you can use like some voices in here. Here, whatever you want. And you can select for whatever you want. And visibility, do you want it public or unlisted or private? Depending on whatever you want. You can, of course, even add this, give it an image. You can generate an image, as an example. So, a guy uh, testing conversations with others let's say what's picture they will come with so click on regenerates and yeah i'll just do this one as an example and click on select to select it which will be great so yeah i'll just do here and click on create character and as you can see this character is created so now once you have it you should uh, share the link of it for in your discord server so just go to your discord type discord.com in a new tab hit the enter button you'll have to log in into your account if you have an account if you don't you'll have to go and create a new one if you don't know how of course i've already made a video on how it's how to do it and go to your server as an example in my case this is going to be my server in here so all that you need to do simply go to your character ai click on this icon below your uh, profile picture click on it and you can see you'll find the link in here so this link, just go and click on copy link, go to your Discord server as example, and click on it. So here, just type like, you can use this chat, guys, to chat with a random 
sister chats but made by me as an example and people let's say as an example i have this so i'll just go open a cognito and open that and let's see where it will take us so as an example they will tell me to create or to log in into an account you'll not be able to chat without creating an account so it seems like I'll not be able to use an incognito, but if I click on it, I'll be taken right away to that. And I'll just type hello as an example. Let's see what he's going to respond with. So, hello, how are you doing? Uh, can I test chatting with you as an example? So, basically, here people will be able to chat with it. As you can see, sure, I'm here to chat with you and etc. So I'll just type my example. What is your name? Let's see. So what is your name? Let's see example. So my name is sister and yours. I don't know. I'll just type. Uh, my name is. So my name is Omex. Why is your name like sister? Let's see what he's going to respond with. So. As you can see, because I was created to test things, so people call me tester. Yeah, that's a good answer, I guess, for AI to say. So, yeah, as you can see, your now character is added to your Discord server. Of course, you can even integrate some uh, character AI that you can discover from here. Go and look for it. You can even test it if it's working as intended or as you want. You can manage some or give them like a specific chats or to have access to. And yeah, like I guess that's it. So you'll be able even to click on on it here if you want to edit something about the tester. As example, uh, you can make it private for private people, uh, for just people that has link or enlist uh, enlisted for just available for people that to chat with that they have link. If you want, don't want to like publish it publicly. And yeah, this is going to be it for us. So for you, congratulations. You successfully connected your character AI to this code, opening and exciting possibilities for automated interactions and content generation or chatting generation. So experiments with different like features and characters and functionalities to make the most out of this integration. If you have any question or there is a specific question or topic that you would like me to, uh, to do in the next tutorial, just drop it down below in the comment section. I'll try to do this as soon as possible. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next video. So goodbye.